And it's lights out and away we go. It seems like everybody got away. Sebastian Venkov leading the pack. We'll just go back to the middle here and see what's happening at the back here. Go down the inside goes Deacon Olifield trying to get past Sebastian Ferreira, bumping him, losing control of his cart. Maddox Mason falling all the way to the back. Unfortunate bystand in that uh, exchange there. Then Caleb Boss moves, moves up back into second place after losing a position. Can everybody make it past the first couple of corners and continue going? We've got number 307 off at the back. Alonso Diaz trying to get going there. All right. So Sebastian Venkov leading the way. Got a clean start and is leading from the get-go. Then Caleb Boss following very close behind. Not very close. A couple of carts behind, but he's going to try and catch up. Then uh, Caleb Caleb Moss second, Mateo Mason. Ooh, we've got a guy that spun off at the back. It seems like Taylor Patel, I believe. Well, at least uh, Sebastian Ferreira didn't take too much of a risk there. Oh, Caleb Moss flips his card. He's out of the race. That's Caleb Moss out. That means he's going to start at the back of the grid. All right, in any case, seems like Patel's just having a chill there. Oh, Maddox Mason, Mateo Mason flipping, but he landed back on his wheels. Wow, very, very fortunate there. Mat Mateo lives to fight another day. Boys are just too aggressive with these cards. So currently, we have first place at the moment is Sebastian Venkov leading the way with a FK card. Then Ferreira, also Formula K, as well as Deacon Willifir uh, with the Formula K. Deacon is running his debut race. He's very, very first race. I see uh, Alonso Diaz also managed to park it into the golf club. Maybe fans is a little bit golf and no more karting for the rest of this race. We'll just see if we can do an onboard with Deacon Willifir. Deacon Willifir sends it down the inside of Sebastian Ferreira into the first corner. Sebastian Ferreira is trying to do the cutback. He's going to have the line for the 180s though, so Sebastian Ferreira is going to send it back down the inside into the 180s. Very tight through there though, but he manages to survive, which puts him in a good position to block off the attack from Deacon Willifir. Very, very good defensive driving from Ferreira there. And Deacon Willifir uh, just needs to try and figure out what he can do next. Yo, Mateo Mason also retired, so we only have five cots remaining on the track. Wow, half the grid gone. Oh, Willifir, now he flips it, and he's out as well. Got a little bit too greedy with the curbs. And that is the end of his pre-final. Unfortunately, Deacon Willifield flipped his cart. Of course, it is fixed setup, so he's he's got his driving ability dialed into a T because the cart is the same for all the drivers on track. Here we go. Final corner for Venkov. Taking the pre-final. Easy pickings for Venkov. Got a good start, and he never looked like losing that at all. Then Sebastian Ferreira. Got himself into second place, and then Maddox Mason in third, Jensen Diaz in fourth, and then five retired carts on track. And it's lights out and away we go. There we go. Venkov getting a very, very quick start again. Diaz keeping it clean on the outside. Is he going to be able to pull away there? M Maddox Mason moves himself up into second. Mateo Mason pushes himself through there. Deacon Willifield goes through as well. Caleb Moss is going to try and keep it clean. We've got a cart stuck. Taylor Patel's not even driving. Venkov flips his cart. He's out of the race into the 180s. He's out of the race. The favorite to win manages to flip his cart into the 180s. Out he is. That is heartbreak. Absolute heartbreak for Venkov. Now, Ma Mateo Mason's all over Sebastian Ferreira. Is he going to be able to get... Wow, look at Caleb Moss. He's already up. Up all the way up into what is that fourth place? So, oh no! Mateo Mason taking Sebastian Ferreira out there on the start finish straight. Now we've got RKT one two three. What on earth happened there? Maybe just the lapse of judgment. But here we go. It's the battle of the RKT boys. Now it's all about bragging rights. The current championship leader versus the current champion, or the defending champion, and the new prospect of Caleb Moss. These boys battle each other in the real life in the Mini Rock division. Uh, let's see who's going to be able to walk away with bragging rights for the next race. As it stands, it's Maddox Mason leading away with Mateo Mason all over him. But all over Mateo Mason is Caleb Moss who runs wide. Very, very unfortunate there. 
Sebastian Ferdas out. Oh, going down the inside into the golf club. As we head into the golf club is Matteo Mason. But down the inside of Maddox Mason is Caleb Mossum. Maddox went from first to third there. Very opportunistic uh, pass there by uh, Caleb Moss. He, he was quick to pounce on that. But now he's going to go down the inside on the start. Finish straight. Going to try and make a pass into the first corner we go. Caleb Moss down the inside. He goes up into first. Caleb Moss virtually started at the back of the pack and he found himself up into first already. Go Maddox Mason now into that slip swim. He should be able to gain and gain and gain all the way down into the first corner and potentially make a move into the 180s. Here we go. Maddox Mason is all over. Caleb was running wide there. Not to be for the 180s potential pass. Guys don't want to spend too much time fighting. It's all about pushing away from the boys behind him. But here we go. Again, onto the back straight we go. Caleb Moss, Maddox Mason. Who's going to be able to send? Oh, they touched. They touched again. How on earth did these guys manage to keep their cards going into the golf club? That was way, way, way too scary. Way too scary for me. I see the battle heating up between Matteo Mason and Deacon Willifield. Will Matteo Mason be able to do something about this final podium spot? As it seems, well, as it stands, it seems like Matteo Mason is going to try and get a... Oh, he's going to send it down the inside into the first corner. He's made his intent known from halfway down the straight. Very, very good racing there. And into the 180s we go. Deacon Willifield. Oh, Matteo Mason losing control of his cart. And unfortunately, just a little bit of a bump there from Deacon Willifield. No fault of Deacon Willifield. That is, Matteo Mason lost control there. And his potential to get himself up into third place and get a podium has fallen out of the window for the time being. Right, down the inside goes Sebastian Ferreira or Jensen Diaz. Ferreira making his uh, intent well known again. Down the start, finish straight. Guys pull out quite early. Let the guy know, I'm coming down the inside. There's nothing you can do about it. And there we go. Uh, Caleb Moss, very defensive. Oh, and taken out by Maddox Mason again. Another accident by the guys misjudging the position on track completely. RKT boys have unfortunately been a little bit naughty tonight. Um, uh, spinning a couple kids on the start, finish straight there. Oh, I see a card flip there. The back who's off. Matteo Mason, another flip from Matteo, two laps to go. He did finish more than 70 or 67% of the race, so he will score points. Here we go. Now the last lap started by, it was going to get started by young Maddox Mason. We'll follow him uh, on board. Right, as we follow Maddox Mason for a final lap onto the 180s we go. Second 180s. Quite tight through there, if I'm honest. Out, I believe this is Cosmic. And then down the start, finish, or the back straight we go. Looking over his shoulder just to check. And he realized there's nobody behind him into the golf club we go. And the exit of the golf club. And then down into the very, very scary pit bend. And over the start finish we go with Maddox Mason just celebrating. And then Deacon Willifield getting himself up into second place. Sebastian Ferreira salvaging a third place after a very unfortunate fight. Ooh, Jensen Diaz moves up into third place because of a time penalty for Ferreira. So that remains to be seen.